I didn't think you'd come. I'll find something relatively clean for you to sit on. Can I get you something to eat or drink? I have water. I came here to see you, Meryl. You don't have to fuss over me. You're so kind. My first guest and I'm already a terrible host. I wanted to thank you for bringing me here, but I'm making a mess of it. You're so sweet, Meryl. Not as sweet as you, that is. Good wishes are a poor gift after all you've done for me. I haven't exactly had many friends. Not even among my own clan. This is... tricky. What made you unpopular with the Dalish? Being first to the Keeper, I was always a bit secluded. I studied magic and history while the others were learning the Via Tanadal. It's good that I left. I'd have made a terrible Keeper. I was never that good with people. You seem to be getting the hang of it already. I'm glad you think so. Thank you for coming to visit me, Hawk. It means a lot to me. This city is amazing. Do you know I saw someone get mugged? Right outside. It was fascinating. Everything happens here all at once. How does anyone keep it all straight? Someone has jumped outside your door, and that's exciting? It must be the Alien Age greeting. Hasn't happened to me yet, though. They must not like me. It's so busy here. So many things just get... lost. Do you miss the Dalish? I miss her and Pival stories. The creaking of Aravels in the breeze. The city is so busy and confusing. And the elves here are not like my clan. But I'll get used to Kirkwall in time. The Templars haven't found you, have they? I've been careful. Even among the Dalish. Keepers never work magic in public. And I think the Templars don't even see me. I'm just another elf in the alienage. Are you feeling lost here, Meryl? A bit. But... I'll adjust. I'm glad you came by. I needed someone to talk to. I had a friend like you once. Got in all kinds of trouble. Dragged me along. Didn't think I'd be doing that again. I got a bit weighty the last time we talked. Sorry for putting that on you. You can tell me anything. Anything? Be careful what you offer. I just... I hope I didn't seem too selfish when I told you about justice. I didn't know what would happen. I figured a willing host, a friend, it had to be better than playing the demon and haunting some corpse. We can't always predict the outcome of our actions. We can only make them with a true heart. Kind, wise, and beautiful. You must have made a deal with some demons yourself. I'm sorry, I shouldn't presume. I just... We've hardly met and I feel like I know you. Am I making you uncomfortable?
keep telling me I'm beautiful. You can't go wrong with that. Oh, I'm sure I can get more creative. No, I, I shouldn't do this. I don't want to hurt you. Why would you hurt me? You saw what I did in the Chantry. That's who I am. A year ago, maybe we could have had something. But I'm not that man anymore. I'll break your heart. And that might kill me as surely as the Templars. seen you since we did that job together for Athenril. Been a while. Heard you're going on some expedition into the Deep Roads, and right into Darkspawn territory. Sure that's wise? It's a risk, but if we succeed, it'll be worth it. Just watch your back. That's all I'm saying. Say, you still in the market for some poisons? Athenril's scarce these days, and the Coterie have their own mixers. You find any rare reagents and want me to whip you up something, just let me know. In fact, since you're an old friend, here's a recipe. My speciality. Everyone needs an edge sometimes, right? has received an audience with the Viscount yet. You there, Ferelden. I wish to speak with you. I've heard you have dealings with certain elements in the city. You can get things done on the sly, as they say. Is there something I can help with? I am a magistrate in this city, and as such, I wish to hire you for a small, albeit important job. A man I sentenced to a life in prison has escaped custody. He's been tracked to an abandoned ruin outside the city. A request that should have been made of the guard. Why is there such a clamor to catch this man? What has he done? He's escaped. That's reason enough to catch him. Is there anything else I need to know? There is something, yes. There are creatures in the ruins. The guards I sent are ill-equipped to deal with such beasts. Do you know what manner of beasts they are? I don't know what they look like. I've never seen one myself. The guards say these things have already torn through a full company of men. It would be easier to seal up the entrance and let the beasts take care of him. I believe in justice, Ferelden. Not unbridled slaughter. I will not let prisoners be eaten just because I don't want to get my hands dirty. I'm sure if you send in enough men this time, they'd do fine. No. The more guards who know, the easier it is for this to get out. Those men gossip like old fishwives. I'll take the job. Bring the fugitive in alive, quickly and quietly. Not only will you be well paid, you'll have the gratitude of a city magistrate. Useful for a refugee, wouldn't you agree?
I've been sent for the man you've cornered here in the ruins. Ah. So you're the reinforcements the Magistrate promised. The man you're looking for, he's holed up in the ruins. Though I doubt he's still in one piece. That bastard's to be brought in alive after all he's done? Just because it isn't you and your pretty little Shemlin children he's after. Please, calm down and tell me what happened. The man you're after, he targets elves! He dragged my daughter into those ruins and killed her! I want him dead! My girl, Leah, uh, she wasn't his first victim. Over the years, he's taken dozens of our children, and not once has he paid for his crimes. Would you mind telling me who you are? Uh, my name is Elrin. I'm a merchant in the city. Please, no one else cares that our children are being slaughtered like beasts. There must be some humans who would take offense to these disappearances. We're nothing to them. Even if this murderer does finally go before the courts, the Magistrate won't take our word over his. Why only elves? Why not human children as well? We're easy prey. No one thinks twice when an elven child disappears. I'm sorry about your daughter, but murdering this man outright is no solution. No! Don't you understand? If you take him in, he'll be free again by nightfall! You have so little faith in the law. For all my damn coin, I'm still only an elf to these shemlin. There'll be no justice for my girl in the courts of Kirkwall. What do you say about all this? Yes. What do you have to say? They won't go in after him. They're stalling. Trying to give the murdering bastard a chance to get away. Oi now, elf. Like we said before, you're bleeding mad if you think we'll be going against the Magistrate's orders. The Magistrates of Kirkwall will pass judgment. Not you or me. I would like that to be true. You don't understand how things work for us elves. There'll be no justice. You'll see. Always where you need.
finish this! you please can you get me out of here i just want to go home leah your father told us you were dead my father is he safe kelder said that he'd hurt my family if i didn't come with him who is kelder the man who took me i don't see any injuries are you all right He hit me, told me I was nothing. I begged him to stop hurting me. I didn't think he would, but out of nowhere, he pushed me away and just started crying. Don't you see? He didn't mean to hurt me. He told me. There are demons. They make him do these horrible things. What kind of demons? What did they look like? I... Don't know what they look like. I didn't actually see any of them. But Kelder told me to run, to get away so they couldn't make him hurt me anymore. Please don't kill him. It's not his fault. Please. Kelder is dangerous, Leah. If he fights back, I can't promise he won't get hurt. He won't fight you, I promise. Run to the entrance. You'll find your father there. I knew my father would eventually send someone. I was hoping the beasts down here would get to me first. You wanted those creatures to kill you. Why? It's what I deserve. I should be torn apart, forgotten down here, not protected by my father. The Magistrate sent me. I've never even met your father. He didn't tell you, did he? The Magistrate is my father. He's tried so hard to keep me... and what I've done... hidden away. I'm disgusted by the both of them. The Magistrate's more worried about keeping his job than doing his job. 
father is a good man. He tried to help to stop me, but he can't. No one can. That elf girl, she had no right to be so beautiful, so perfect. The demon said she needed to be taught a lesson, like all the others. The circle was supposed to help me, but they lied. They said there were no demons, that I was mad. This isn't my fault. Leah said you told her to run. Why? I was... crying, and she asked me if I was all right. After everything the demons made me do to her. She was concerned about me. How could I let them destroy something so good? So pure? Let me get this straight. You torture and murder elven children for being too beautiful. I... I didn't want to hurt them. They force me. The demons don't like it when they cry. It's obvious that you're not well. You need help. No. I'm not mad. It's the demons. Coward. Doesn't even have the balls to own up to his own depravity. I can't stop. I've tried so many times. Please, you have to kill me. There's no other way. First smart thing he said. Give him what he wants. Just tell my father I'm sorry. For everything. Let the courts sort this out. It may end the same way, eventually. No! I don't want to hurt anyone else. I'd rather die. Have you ever been out in the open ocean in a storm? It's the best feeling in the world. I... I said not to hurt you. I said... Shush, girl. You don't know what you're saying. You're still in shock. You let him live, even after what he did. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. You shem stick together. He's right here. Finish him off, if you like. I doubt he'll put up much of a fight. No, Papa! I need to get my family out of Kirkwall. That's the only way we'll be safe from that monster. We'll take the prisoner from here. The Magistrate will be happy to see him in one piece.
I found your son. Son? I don't know what you're talking about. If you stop pretending nothing's wrong, maybe you can help him. You think you know it all, don't you? Your tone says there's truth to this. I am not going to lose my son because a handful of elves make up ridiculous stories. You'll not mention this again. You paid for my services, not my silence. And I'd say that to you, silence is worth just as much. Are you blackmailing me, you disgusting, pathetic? Fine. Take it. I do not want to see or hear from you again.